G'day, I'm Mark from Self Sufficient Me, and what's holding you back from doing what you want? Today is Anzac Day here in Australia, lest we forget. Last week, you might have noticed I didn't post any videos, and there's a good reason why. Family. So it's for this reason that I do try to make a conscious effort to sometimes drop everything else completely and make the space and time to concentrate on family first without any other distractions. Last week we had great fun as a family, but I didn't put the camera down for the whole time. So here's a little of what we got up to. We got stuck into the garden. My wife's up there. She pulled out this plant. I've just potted back a medium berry. She pulled it out by accident when she was doing the weeding. She is looking sheepish up there. She was very apologetic. Unfortunately, I don't think this is going to make it. Come on, buddy, you can do it. We painted Luke's room. My uncle and auntie came down and checked on their native bees that they keep here on our property. Loaded, yeah. loaded with honey. Oh, this is your, this honey is the super. honey super yeah. that you've put in. Well, they've done a good job, I'm surprised. Yeah. And how much longer are you gonna leave that one on there? Oh, I'll go around in the spring and, and uh, rob them. Okay, yep. Hello, you brought it back, Gouda. Gouda remembered. We're further over there, dog. Now back where you first went, dog. Keep going. Right there, no. You're nearly at it. No, behind you, boy. Behind you. No, behind you. Back there, yeah, back there. Whoa, to the right. <laughs> hey, to the right, over there. He just didn't go far enough. They bought us a red pawpaw, which was absolutely delicious. And I turned most of it into a pawpaw fruit leather.
cherries. Cherries. Or something. It's chewy. Mmm. It tastes nice. Good. So I'm going to try to grow some red pawpaw with these seeds. But as a backup, I bought a couple of red pawpaw plants from the nursery just in case the pawpaw seed thing doesn't work because these are beautiful. You know what? I prefer these fruit leathers, the pawpaw fruit leathers, to the actual fresh pawpaw. Mm. Went to an air show here just locally where my cousin's husband and her son Marco were flying warbirds. It was a great day out. Marco is only 16 years old and he just completed his maiden solo flight in a warbird, the youngest warbird pilot in Australia. How cool is that? And he hasn't even got his car license yet. And so what was it like doing your maiden flight? Uh, it was pretty surreal, I guess. Was it? A little bit nervous? Uh, nervous taxiing to the point where I had to take off. Yeah. As soon as I took off, I was focused. And what were you flying in? CSC Windjill, so what my dad's flying at the moment. Okay. Yeah. 16 and flying your own war birds. Wow. And so is that up here in the air at the moment? Uh, yeah, it's in formation. It's over there in the distance. Which one is it? Can you see from uh, here? I'd say it's the Okay, the lead one. <laughs> it's still the front one? So those were the highlights, lots of fun, and even the quiet times were just great to enjoy with family lazing around. Success, or even the pursuit of success, however you wanna measure what success is, according to you, is important. It's very important to be driven in life. However, it shouldn't be at the expense of family. But here's a secret that you probably know already. You can have both. Remember, just do what you want, but think of family first. Thanks a lot for watching. If you enjoyed the video, give it a big thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already. Support me on Patreon if you do. Support people over there, that'd be terrific. Bye for now. Nice job. What? Hmm. He could have made his bed. <laughs>